YouTube, and today I'm going to be going in depth really quick with you guys how to read a weather radar. So I'm just going to go straight through it with you guys. I like to describe it like this. Uh, there's this thing called the weather spectrum, at least that's why I like to call it. It goes from blue being the weakest to pink being the strongest. And it ranges from the colors blue, green, yellow, red, and then pink, of course. And I'm just going to go straight through it from left to right. So blue is obviously the weakest area of precipitation. If you're seeing just, let's just note this, just blue on radar, if you're seeing little specks of blue, it probably means there's like little to no precipitation on radar, and there's really nothing to worry about. However, if you're seeing blue along with green or yellow in the center, then it probably means there's a shower in progress and you probably want to take all your outdoor activities inside and i will be I'll, I'll be pulling some pictures at the end of this video to just illustrate what i just said because some of this is kind of hard but i'll try to do as best as i can so if you're seeing blue with green and then yellow and then red in the center of a storm or shower or whatever, it typically means that there's a lot of heavier precipitation, there might be some minor flooding, but this is a stronger you know, form of precipitation if you're seeing red on radar. Now, if you're seeing a lot of pink on radar, like let's just say, I'm just gonna try and illustrate this as best as I can. So if you're seeing blue on the outside and then green and then yellow and then red and then pink, in the very center, like a circle, that tip, well not a circle, but whatever. Um, if you're seeing that kind of formation, then it typically means there's a very, very strong thunderstorm, and there could be hail, I mean very small hail, and maybe some damaging winds, but it does, if you're seeing pink on your radar, it typically means there is a stronger thunderstorm that is capable of producing more things than just rain, obviously, or heavy rain, let's just say that. Um, so if you're seeing all that, take your weather precautions. Okay, so here's a picture of what I basically just tried to summarize. Okay, so I hope that, you know, helped to illustrate in your head of what I just tried to say. Um, so, if you have any questions about what I just said, let me know down in the comment section below immediately. And I will be sure to answer it as soon as possible. Uh, I hope this video helped you guys understand more about, like, weather radars, how they work, and what they look like. And, um, yeah, I hope this helped you. Do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel, especially if you're into weather. If, you, um, if you're into weather, this is the perfect channel for you. I really, really hope this helped you guys. And I think I'm going to close it off here. I hope this helped, and I will see you in the next video. Adios.